There's a warning for parents and pet owners across our first coast. There are new reports of hawks swooping down on small animals more than usual on the East Coast. First Coast News, Lana Harris joins us live in Riverside with this story. Lana? Yeah, so hawks, eagles, and owls, they're all predatory animals. So swooping down from the trees and snatching up small animals, it's something that they do year round. But experts say that this time of year, you could see that happen even more. It's the sound that makes cats take cover under cars. Dogs cling tighter to their owners and chickens head for the coop. It's the sound of a hawk. And right now, they're on the hunt. Oh, yes. You see them daily flying around. Betty Hodges says one even landed on her rooftop. He happened to be eyeing some kittens we had in the backyard. So then I had to take up the kittens and put them in a secure place. A post on the social media app next door warned people that hawks seem to be out in force on the East Coast going after small animals. <laughs> So we asked Karen Parker with the FWC. During this time of year, I would definitely maintain the supervision over my pet. This time of year, it's mating season. They're building their nests, they're having young. This time of year, it really do get territorial. Like a true mama and papa bird, Parker says they won't want to let you anywhere near these babies. They dive at people, they get too close to the nest. If, and if even it's a dog or a cat, you know, if, you, if the animal gets too close, you know, they may view as a threat to the nest. Parker says hawks could also be preying on smaller animals more to feed their new babies. Rodents, small mammals, or a puppy and kittens could definitely be preyed upon. She says the best way to protect your small pets is to never let them roam freely and to keep animal attractants out of your yard. Like get rid of your bird feeders, um, unsecured garbage, fallen bird seed and pet food. These are common attractants that may entice the predators in into your property. Now, Parker says that mating season is from now until summer. And if you or your animal does come into contact with a hawk or any predatory animal, that you should seek medical attention. In Riverside, Lana Harris, First Coast News, on your side. Lana, thank you.